A lot of people think I hate college. I do. I got the title of this video from this question. Miss Freaky18 says, I've been a big fan of you always, and you made me fall in love with networking more. Awesome. Thank you. Glad to hear that. And I want to pursue my certificates now after so many years. What is your advice for my new journey? My head explodes with all kinds of advice because it speaks to the heart of a lot of what I do and why I do what I do. First off, I, I'm sorry, Miss Freaky 18. I, I don't want to pick apart uh, your question, but I kind of do because you said um, you made me fall in love with networking more and more. And, and, and I, I love that and I appreciate that, but I want to make sure that love for networking is yours. Passionate people are addictive, as in we hear passionate people all the time on YouTube, on movies, on anything. You, you just, you're drawn to their passion because it's their passion. But what I've seen a lot is people will adopt that passion as their own, but it's not really their own. They're just excited because someone's excited and anytime somebody's excited, it's great to jump on with them. The reason I'm passionate about networking is because I fell in love with networking and I wanna make sure that happened for you too because I'm gonna feather that right into the next part of your question. You said, I wanna go after certificates, any advice? And I would say, make sure that the certificates that you're going after are applying to something. I guess, bigger, bigger picture, know your why. Why are you going after that certificate? And I, and I want to make sure it's not just because I'm passionate about it. Make sure it's because you're passionate about it or as you're studying and learning more, your, your passion is growing because that's really how you grow your passion. I'm very rarely passionate about something when I began. Even when I got into Cisco years ago, I was like, oh, this is drudgery because you're sitting there trying to figure stuff out. And when you don't understand something, it's the worst. It happens every time I get into a new technology. I'm like, oh, this is miserable. I mean, give me an Apple computer and I'm like, oh, misery. While some people love it, they love it because they've dedicated themselves enough to understand it. And they're like, I love Apple computers, right? So, so the point is that know your why and go after it. Now, most of the time people going after certifications are doing it because they want to get a better job, right? So stop there. That's your why. If that's your why, maybe you want to get a better job, you want to make more money, you just want more knowledge, what, whatever it is, if that's your why, then go after that why and use the certification to get there. Don't go after the certification and then achieve it and then go, what do I do now? A lot of people think I hate college. I do, <laughs> but, but not for the reason that you think. I think college is phenomenal when you have a why. I'm going there because I want to achieve this. The reason I hate college is because they prey on the weakest of them. That is, those coming out of high school that don't really know what they want to do yet. And their parent says, you need to go to college and get an education. And so they go and they're like, oh, I guess I'll do that. Four years later and hundreds of thousands of dollars in debt, they walk away going, I, I still don't know what I'm, what I'm here for. I, I would love college if they would add a... a add a gap, uh, whatever it is, develop something. I'm sure somebody's done this to where you help somebody fall in love or, or determine what they're really good at. What are you gifted at? What are you created to be? Help somebody discover that, give them their why, and then launch them into the education. And I know this isn't a video about college. It just kind of ended up that way because you asked you to, what, what advice about certificates. What I'm saying is know your why, what are you going to, and then use the certifications to achieve that.